Quiet is not the word to describe the famous tenant who lives in this Oakland marina. I love making scrambled eggs in the morning. <laughs> Crazy is a better word. Who is this man? Crazy George, professional cheerleader and professional male model. You yell, try it, or you swallow this! All right, there's our team coming out. Hey, um, I'm gonna be watching you close this game! Since 1975, Crazy George Henderson has been a hot commodity. Hundreds of sports teams from football, baseball, hockey, and soccer, the pros, the minors, have hired him to do one job, to make the crowd go bonkers. The moment I walk through that tunnel, I'm ready. And I just look at all the fans, and the thing that gets me going the best is to see a full stadium. His career began in the late 60s, while he was a high school teacher in Santa Clara. Those poor kids! I warped their minds! He was given his trademark drum and began banging it at school events. People went nuts. He started doing it for a local hockey team and caught the eyes of teams in the Midwest and Canada. And there was money in it. A career was born. I cheer for the Minnesota Vikings for four years, the Kansas City Chiefs for four years, the Houston Oilers for eight years, the Titans for one year. Of course, when it came to cheering, no one could ignore the A's 10th man, Crazy George Henderson. With demand for George so high, it wasn't uncommon for teams to fight over him. And because he turned home team stadiums into noise pits, he occasionally ticked off visiting team coaches. What I really think is I made an art form out of is back and forth cheers across the stadium. I always go two hours, three hours early, and then for like 20 minutes, 30 minutes, before anybody's in there, I go down and sit in the stands all by myself. At 56, he still travels to a different city each weekend. All expenses paid, and several hundred bucks on top of that. But for George, he's retired himself from the massive pro sports crowds. It's brutal. I mean, it's brutal on me now. It was brutal on me then, but it would be a killer. And so I just, I try to approach just minor league sports right now. Well, I got my jersey. I'm ready to go into my private dressing room to change for the game. And he's never given up on his favorite local venue. San Jose Giants. Hello, everybody! Thanks for coming out! So you get $5 from your dad, and then give it to me. It's called softening up the crowd, getting them ready. So I just go around and make sure they know who I am. If they don't know who I am, I get mad! Bobblehead doll, this is the greatest bobblehead doll I ever saw. This thing is absolutely cute and beautiful. Yes, the world's craziest and beloved male cheerleader, forever immortalized in a bobblehead. A fitting tribute to a man that has made millions stand up and cheer. That was perfect!